Well, we wanted to have the opportunity to, one, try to find out our best combination. We're a young team, and just like they are young, I'm still trying to figure out what's best for the, for the team to help us get to that winner circle. So we, we wanted to work on uh, different combinations and maybe give us that, that winning edge as well as uh, the things that we've been putting in all year, uh, looking for how well we execute our offense defensively, uh, what's going to be the toughest group, uh, who will sustain an effort uh, the longest period of time, what five guys would do that. Uh, but we worked on our defensive scheme of things. Uh, mm -hmm. We like to do a lot of things defensively. We change our defense quite a bit. And because of that, I thought our pl kids played with a lot of intensity for an uh, extended period of time. I thought we gave a good 30-minute effort. Uh, obviously, that's a 40-minute game. So we're still trying to uh, sustain that type of effort for 40 minutes uh, by a collective group of guys. Well, we have uh, what we say is brotherhood. Mm -hmm. We hold each other accountable. Uh, they get on each other, uh, but they also try to pick each other up when they're down. Um, but we also know if we're going to be good, that's got to be a collective will. And because of that collective will, we feel like that can help us uh, change the dynamics, direction the program is going in. And so, um, this team that we have is a group of guys who uh, are very uh, conscientious. Uh, they got good work ethic. Every now and then I've got to push them a little bit, but they don't mind that. They're very coachable guys. And because of that, I think that's going to take us further down the road. Well, um, we think that Milligan College is, uh, they're well coached, they're very disciplined. Um, they don't make a lot of mistakes. Uh, they won't be the, themselves, they hoping that Lamar will beat Lamar. And so we've got to continue to bring a, a good effort. Uh, we've got to be driven uh, even more so. We can't have any letdowns. We've got to stay focused on the matter at hand. Uh, we understand that uh, at the end of every game there are two states, uh, the thrill of victory and the agony of defeat. And we've experienced both. But we know that at this time of year we need to uh, put together some W's uh, because that's important to have build some momentum going into conference play. Well, you know, Milligan College uh, in college basketball, there's a lot of parity. You can't sleep on any team. Uh, you can't take Milligan College lightly. Uh, they're well coached. They're a good basketball team. Uh, we're going to have to bring our A game again. Uh, we've got to make sure we pay attention to detail. Um, but it's very important uh, that we have uh, a good approach right off the start. start. We've got to set the tone early on. Uh, we can't let this team uh, stay around because they can be a dangerous basketball team. So we've got to uh, make sure that we're very consistent in, in uh, winning. Uh, you know, you can add wins, but you can't subtract losses. And our guys understand that. And so with that being understood, They've got to make sure when we go out on the floor on Friday tonight that we go out uh, with the approach. Uh, this is a business, a business approach, and we've got to take care of our business and protect our home court.